Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Our first stop in creating object-oriented database would be the uh, download and installation of the CMAP tools. This is a free tool. Uh, we found at ftp.ihmc.us, as seen on the screen. Once you've downloaded this, you'll be able to basically register your name and select the version that you wish. In our case, it's Windows. Submit and download the 64-bit version. Having completed this, we will then run the installation and begin working with it. Um, once you've got it installed, you will be uh, executing the CMAP uh, icon, and it will bring up essentially a uh, blank screen here but in our case uh, in order to build databases we use this tool for both documentation purposes and for the actual design of our models for example this is one model that's already been created uh, and this allows us to create new fields uh, for whatever reason that we uh, require and add to the system and as you can see it will not affect the rest of the model once we've done this we would simply export that cmap as a cxl file with an object of the same name as you see we've already done and all right yes okay voila once this is complete um this now will serve as the metadata or the diagram for our or one of our models within our database. Uh, moving forward from that, we can also build as complicated a, a solution as we wish. It is not restricted to very simple solutions, as you will see. It can be quite complex. Uh, in our world, uh, the associative world, this is how we design, create, and develop databases. So no matter what your mind can create, we can accomplish. We have now launched Atomic DB. Um, we will move ahead uh, with the importation to demonstrate that model. As you can see, there is nothing there. We will use the existing model that we exported to create a new database. And there we go. The database is now completely operational. Uh, just so we are uh, absolutely clear, we can also include additional uh, database or models if we wish and complexity is not an issue again I would bring back the very complex model the banking model to demonstrate how quickly and efficiently we can produce databases using the associated database technology in atomic DB and essentially there we go this is now a working model uh, about 400 fields in a single model and or if you wish a separate model a smaller one thank you